Good morning, everybody. We're going to continue the week of reviews with our look at... We're going to start the Elton John Vegas Residencies review series today with his first Vegas Residency DVD, The Red Piano, which um, the inspiration for the title of the his first Vegas show came from love because he always um, he always he always um, he he always thought the color red coincided with love which it kind of does um, but the DVD itself was released in 2008, and the show was filmed at Caesar's, pa- Caesar's Palace in Las Vegas uh, for, I believe, four years until 2018, I believe, or, um, uh, um, anyway, for a long time. And the the set list is kind of um, um, it kind of runs the gamut of his career. He opens with Benny and the Jets, which is kind of abnormal. I've never seen him open a show with that. And he runs through songs like Philadelphia Freedom and uh, Believe, which is a song that uh, comes from Made in England, which I had never seen him do, so I was I was pleased uh, to see that on the set list. And a really nice version of Rocket Man, which features uh, the Justin Timberlake, uh, I believe the Justin Timberlake video from uh, this train don't stop or um, this train don't stop here anymore and uh, as I as I stated in the um, review for the movie Rocket Man I think Justin would have been a better choice to play Elton in the movie because he really embodied embodied Elton in the uh, video for Rocket Man, and um, one of the highlights for me of the whole of the Red Piano was seeing Elton do uh, Pinball Wizard because I had never seen him do do that live, and of course the visuals for the sh- the show were stunning. You know, because this is, this is Vegas, and, um, you know, they have to, they have to take it up a notch. And, like, for, for the, um, for Pinball Wizard, they had him, they had a video of, you know, a pinball, you know, and a pinball machine sounds, and it was just, it was just cool. And, um, I, I love some of the jokes he told at the, at the show. He, uh, makes reference to Celine Dion, who had, at the time, had a Vegas residency, too. And he makes reference that, um, normally this is Celine's house, but not tonight, um, and he makes reference to the fact that he is stuck behind the piano, well, he, as he calls it, the uh, nine-foot red plank, and the fact that he can't move, move around. And the stage, and he also makes reference to the fact that the... the, the stage at the Coliseum is huge and it takes him forever to walk across it back to the piano 
and um, at the end during um, Saturday Night's All Right for Friday, it, he has dancers come up and kind of like do a go-go dance to the um, to the song, but that's the only part of the show that I find corny. Uh, the rest of it is just amazing. And uh, coming up next in this series, probably next, um, probably next Saturday, we will be uh, concluding the series with his a million dollar piano uh, Vegas show. And so I hope you enjoy it. Oh, by the way, the DVD was released in 2008. And and also, uh, a two CD version uh, was released um, along with the DVD. Uh, but I don't think it's, um, I think the, uh, two CD and the DVD versions are kind of, um, special releases, so I don't think they got a wide release to the general public. 